Lewis's feelings towards us angers me because he doesn't know us. We're not bad people. We're taking care of a baby because we want what's best for him. It's nappy time. Jill is a bitch. I highly suspect that they are gonna raise Milo as the son they never had together. I didn't want Vincent to have custody of Milo because he's immature. I really believe babies need to be with their mothers. Oh, sleepy baby. I don't want Jill to have custody of Milo because she's not his mother. We ended up going to court. Lewis feels they should have custody, although he's home maybe two days a month. Jill said a lot of negative things about Vincent. I felt that Milo was better off in our care. Vincent was told to read a caption from Facebook. He used my Facebook against me. I had to read it to everyone in the courtroom. Does it look like a dumbass? And if I did, it wouldn't fit in the picture. Ask your mom or some, something along those lines. <laughs> Tasteless. Does that make you a bad father? No. The judge actually found Vincent to be immature and stated him to be an unfit father. Jill has used the legal system to kidnap my grandson from his parents. The judge ruled in our favor. We have custody of Milo. I don't want anything to do with Jill or Mike anymore. This gives Kayla the opportunity to be a part of Milo's life and ample opportunity to become a mother. What's on your shirt? I don't think I would help Jill if she was burning on a cross. Milo needs to be raised by his parents, not by some psycho grandmother that wants to be somebody's hero. Okay, well, you've met all the players involved in this, and, and now we're meeting Lewis, who is Vincent's father. And, I mean, we've got to be trying to figure out who's right and who's wrong in this deal. I promise you by the end of the show, you're going to know who I think that is and who I think's doing the right thing and what needs to take place. Lewis, you, you said you agreed to do the show for basically one reason, right? And that was to make her look like an idiot. No. You didn't say that? No, she, uh, she does that naturally. <laughs> yes, by raising a nine-month-old for your child, she makes herself and look like an idiot. that your job to the mom? Vincent. Yeah, but if it's Vincent. the best place for our son, but I don't <clears> see... <throat> Like, honestly, if you look at it as you don't have a job either, you're I, still in high school. What do you think needs to happen here? God gave them the gift of paternity. And with responsible adults, Vincent and Kayla should be raising their child, not take them away like a Nintendo game when they don't behave. You gotta be there for your kids every single day of your life no matter what failures well, who they are encounter. the responsible adults here you said as responsible adults raising a child who are the responsible adults here it could have been jill my wife and i have helped my daughter raise her her daughter so far and we're doing quite well so do y'all want to take the baby and raise it since day one he was there the day he was born next to him on the incubator why do you say she is a psycho grandmother no, he's the psycho. He's the psycho? She's a mindless idiot. <laughs> Why do you say that? Based on their actions and all of the postings I have read from her to my wife. Yeah, let's just cause problems when we have a child. Right, do me on. a favor, hold shut on. your mouth. Let people uh, uh, speak when uh, it's their turn. Hold on, hold um, on. I was told I could interrupt hold you, so I'll on. do as I please. Hold on. I'm 18 years old. Hold on. Ready to get real? Subscribe to the Dr. Phil Show YouTube channel for exclusive videos you won't see anywhere else.